Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss how to take out a loan in the hodler market from Definer. This video is part of a series of videos um, that will teach you how to use the hodler market. So if you haven't seen the previous two videos about how to make a deposit and how to enable your crypto asset as collateral, please go back and watch them and this will make much more sense. So once you're in your dashboard, we're working on HODLer Market 25 in this case, uh, we will take out a loan in this example, we're gonna borrow USDT against our collateral. In this case, the FIN token that we have already enabled uh, as collateral. So you, at this point, after you've followed these steps, you have gained borrowing power and by enabling your, your token, in this example, FIN as collateral. So now what you will do is go to your hardware market. In this case, is the mar market number 25 in this example. And then I'll go scroll down to USDT. So remember, what I want here is to use my FIN tokens to borrow um, USDT. So I go to USDT. This is the USDT pool in that market number 25. I scroll down and see my borrowing power. In this case, is about $40, which is correct. Um, we have about $100 worth of FIN deposited and 40% of it is $40. So now that we have the borrowing power clear, then we come up here and go to borrow. So we have up to $40 to use as, as borrowing power. So um, now it's time to borrow what's in the market up to my borrowing power amount. So I will just go ahead and borrow. Actually, if you want to just do 10, I, I think I'm going to go use 10 in this case, $10, just to leave some <laughs> there for others. So uh, now that you have selected that, then you can borrow down here. Let's click on the borrow button there is a small gas fee that you have to confirm confirm and then the transaction is pending just wait for a few seconds and yes transaction successful as you can see here once you have that loan you get that loan you see that your loan balance changes to the ten dollars that you borrowed and then your borrowing power decreases by the amount of your loan that you took out. So to make sure that we have a um, everything in order, I'm just gonna go, go back to my HODLer market portfolio right here, portfolio, HODLer markets, and then go to my mark, which is number 25, and check my collateral asset right here. So as you, as you saw earlier, so you check your collateral asset, just the borrowing power is still $30. So that means that we borrowed uh, $10 against it. So now it's a, it's a new borrowing power. You can see that. So the last thing we, we can do now to just make sure that we have those assets the, the loan, we got the loan right away, is just go to our wallet. So we go to our wallet and um, there we should find, under assets, we should find our borrowed assets. So as you can see here, before, in my first video that I showed you my wallet, I had a, around 149 uh, USDT and now is at 159. Um, so you can see here that um, it was borrowed in the activity. So this is um, how to bo you borrow an asset using your token as collateral in your favorite hollow market. So now you know how to unlock more capital with your crypto assets. And what are you waiting for? Start now with your favorite hodler market.